Mother Merit badges, here we come. Okay, Scouts, information. Official Bear Scout Guide? Right. Map of the Great Roaring River? Right. Life jackets? Right. Incidentally, Scouts, I'm relieved to note that nowhere do I see your laudable father and uncle, the world's greatest expert in just about everything, Papa Q Bear. <laughs> right. Papa Q Bear reporting for Whitewater Merit Badge duty. <coughs> it's mighty nice of you, Papa. And we really appreciate you wanting to help. Yeah, Unc, but you see... Uh, Mr. Bear, have you had any whitewater experience? Have I had whitewater experience? Have I had whitewater experience? How can you ask such a question of yours truly, Papa Q Bear, who's negotiated the upper reaches of the crocodile-infested Nile? Woo! Brave the rapids of the Piranha packed Amazon. Why, one false move in those waters, and you're instant fish food. But, Papa, we're not going on the Nile or up that Amazon. That's right, Uncle. But we are going on Roaring River, which has some serious white water, and I don't want any foolishness. Foolishness? Foolishness? Why, my dear lady, I... Hmm, what's this little doohickey? No need for that. I'll just drag it. Come, the river beckons. Ah, yes, the perfect day for a white water experience. Give me that white water, that white, white water. Braving the rapids with my son and daughter. What about me, Unc? Good point. And my bright and heady nephew, Freddy. Twisting and turning, spinning and turning, hanging on for dear life. Spray so thick you can cut it with a knife. White water, that white, white water. Huh? Where's the white water? It's a mere trickle. I'm all geared up for a rip-roaring, 40-knot knuckle-biter. I want to feel that spray in my teeth. The rapids start farther downstream. I don't see any rapids downstream. That way's downstream, Monk. Oh, of course. Come on, let's get going. I want to earn that merit badge. All right, then. I'll follow along and evaluate your white water performance from my truck. A commendable plan, Scout Leader Jane. And not to worry, you can leave everything in my capable paws. Come on, Papa. Get in the raft. Here's your life jacket. Tut, tut. Life jackets and rubber raft are hardly my style. I'm out to rough it. I toughed out the Nile and the Amazon. And let me tell you about the Mississippi. I've explored it, swam it, abbreviated it. Aha! Here's my trusty dugout canoe. But, Papa, rubber rafts are safer for the rapids. They float high and are designed to bounce off rocks. Rafts might be fine for beginners, but I thirst for adventure. That's why I need a canoe that's indestructible. Oh! See those scars? Those are from crocodile teeth. Oh! Wowee! Yep, there I was, paddling down the most treacherous waterway of all, the intersection of the Nile and the Amazon, surrounded by a couple dozen snapping crocodiles. Then the piranhas came after me. Nyam, 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 nyam. Those scars are piranha teeth. Papa! I thought for sure I was gonna end up fish food but I finally scared them all. Papa! Oh, yes, my dear? Papa, the official Bear Scout guidebook says, something you must never do. You must never stand up in a canoe. Perhaps in an ordinary canoe, but I carved this one myself. I cleverly designed it for stability. 
you patent pending based on the principles of the gyroscope. Quick, grab him. That's it. Here you go. Hang on, Papa. Papa, I think you should put this life jacket on. Well, the color does match my shirt. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, nothing like a warm, leisurely afternoon in my patent-pending canoe floating down a gorgeous river. <sighs> I think I'll take a little snooze. Now's not the time for a nap, Unc. The river's picking up. Freddy's right. We should all stay alert. The guidebook says, never relax. Always, always study your map. And never, ever take time for a nap. Hmm, the river narrows up ahead. That could mean rapids. Maps, guidebooks, nonsense. I know this river like the palm of my paw. Those rapids are miles away. And I got plenty of time for a little R&R. &R. Rest and relaxation. Papa, I think you mean rapids and riptides. Hang on! What's that wrong? Hurry! Hang on, Papa! That's it! We'll get you up! Hang on, Papa! This current is so strong that we may be able to... Pop you up! Whoa. Papa, you all right? <laughs> hey, uh, fine, fine. You're first rate. I merely wanted to see how you scouts would react in an emergency. Phew! Look alive! Fairy boat ahead! What does the guidebook say? Let me see. Under rules of the river, it says, When on the river, during night or day, Always give passengers the right of way. Backwater till they pass. Speaking of rules of the river, these fish are swimming the wrong way on a one-way river. Papa, those are salmon. They're swimming upstream to lay in. For them, that's the right way. Salmon? Salmon! Yum! Uh, salmon. Of course, just testing your knowledge of fish habit. Danger ahead. We'll have to take that little stream. No twisty streams for me. When you're battling a river, you gotta go straight ahead. Ta-ta! But Papa, come on with us. This way's safer. You can't let the river get the upper hand. You gotta show it who's boss. Twisting and turning, spinning and turning, hanging on for dear life, spray so thick you can cut it with Yo! Yo! Oh no! Yeah! Whoa! Oh! Oh! Yeah! Wow! Oh! Oh! Papa! You gotta show the river who's boss. And that's what I'm gonna do. Just as sure as my name is a Papa Q Bear. Did Papa Q Bear? Uh oh, Scout Leader Jane. Sorry, but we're so busy rescuing Papa, we didn't have time to do our merit badge tests. Not so, Scout. I have four merit badges here one for each Scout and one for Papa, who helped by showing you what you should not do. I did? <laughs> of course, merely doing my duty. Yay, Papa! Thanks, Unc. What a great badge. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> yeah, well I'll, I'll add it to my collection. <laughs> Got about a hundred merit badges, you know. Aha! My hat! <laughs>